Ready or not, it's that time of year again. Hard to believe it. It really is hard to believe it. So more than half of consumers have already started their back-to-class shopping. Mm -hmm. And with the prices rising over the last two years, shoppers, of course, looking for some deals. All right. To help school us on how to navigate those school supply lists and find the best bargains, we brought in NBC's Vicki Wynn. Mm -hmm. Hi, Vic. I mean, Hi, in lots, some parts of the country, school starts in a week or two. I know. August is so right around the corner. It's so. not really too early. No, that's not so wrong. if you're starting your shopping, what's the first thing we need to do? Okay, we talked to Andrea Warrock. She's a money-saving expert. She helped us out. This is something I've talked about, too. Take an audit of all the supplies you already have. Oh, yeah. Search the house. Look at the nooks and crannies. Last year's backpack, your desk, your junk drawers. What kind of crayons, markers, supplies do you already have before you even spend a penny? Next, you're going to print out the list, whether it's from your school website, ask the teacher. If you don't, Staples and Walmart have this on their website. You can enter your zip code and your school name, and they'll give you a template of a supply list anywhere from pre really? All the way to 12th grade. Yeah, it's a great little starter wow. list that can help you. And then once the school year starts, you can figure out what else you need. I think sometimes people get overwhelmed, think they have to buy all the things in yeah, the beginning, and true. they don't. And then finally, oh, can we circle this? Yes, never, <laughs> never, never bring never. the kids. Mom, can I have? No, go by yourself. Stay, like it's like Dateline, watch alone. Yes, this is like shopping. <laughs> exactly. Go alone. Yes. A survey that was just done by um, uh, one of these companies, Retail Me Not, said that kid, you spend fifty dollars more yeah. by bringing yeah. your kids with you. Hundred percent. Sorry, it was slick deals. Slick deals. Are you going to okay. tell me lip gloss isn't a school supply? Uh, My know. daughter oh. begs to differ. <laughs> Please. I know. And okay. Then suddenly more things are in your car. I turn All right, Vicky, yeah. let us find some good deals, especially if you want supplies. Where do we start? Okay, so Amazon is a great place to start, specifically the Amazon Basics line, 40% okay. off school supplies right now. They're also doing a deal 20% off if you make a purchase of $50. Now, that sounds like a lot of money, but yeah. if you can, if you have it in your budget, you can also contribute to the classroom, to the teacher. Oh, that's good. Need wipes and sanitizer yes. and paper towels and tissues. You'll All right. get to that 50 before okay. you know it. In addition it. to Amazon. Okay, Target's next. Yeah. They have their dollar bins. Start there. Crane glue sticks, a lot of things under a dollar at Target. So wow. that's a good place to start. Also, I love this. College students, go to the Target website, register with your college ID, your, your email address. You get a coupon for 20% off an entire purchase. Oh, you wow. You're going to college. Wow. You got to buy the microwave, yeah. the warm fridge, the sheets. Wow. All the that stuff? adds up. And if you can get 20% off, do that's it. That's a good tip. And then finally, Walmart's got a deal of uh, $13 for 14 of the most popular school supplies, including markers, pens, Brilliant. all of the things that you're going to need, scissors. Do it. Now, a lot of people don't use paper and pencil or no. pens in Anymore, they use tech. So how can we get a deal on tech? I know, especially if you're sending your kids off to college, that's yeah. going to be the single most expensive uh, item yeah. to purchase. So right now, Best Buy has a lot of deals on their Windows laptops, their Chromebooks. We found some deals up to $600 off. Wow. Apple is another one for college students, rising college students, educators, uh, even homeschoolers and parents of college students. You can uh, uh, qualify for a gift card up to $150 okay. off if you're buying one of their MacBooks, mm -hmm. their computers, or the iPads. And you can use that towards AirPods or some other Apple supplies. 20% off Apple Care, which is their warranty cool. program. And um, finally, go to our mm. next slide, which yeah. will give you our final. Mike. Yes, there yeah. you go, Microsoft. They have this, um, it's a cloud computing thing called uh, Microsoft mm -hmm. 365 Personal. And basically, you're getting all those apps that you use, yeah. Word, PowerPoint, Excel, but you also get uh, identity theft protection, oh, device good. protection, which is really helpful. 50% off. Yeah. All, right. all right, off to Craig. All right, Vic, great deals there. So what are some things that perhaps parents and students should hold off by right now as they head back to school? So according to Retail Me Not, Craig, 17 states are having a tax-free right. holiday. That's a weekend. Sometimes it lasts a week. Right now, it's happening already in Florida. It started Monday. So save all of your big ticket items, all of your school supplies, clothes, shoes, until you can take advantage of that tax-free holiday. Think about it. If you're buying a $1,000 laptop and the sales tax in your state is 7%, you're saving $70. So you add all of that together and add coupons in there, shop through cashback sites like Retail Me Not or Rakuten. You are stacking all of those coupons on top of each other, adding up to hundreds in savings. Next, apparel, you're going to want to wait till Labor Day. That's when oh. the end of the season for summer, you're going to see the best deals on summer clothes. Same thing with sporting goods. Those will go on sale around Labor Day. But my hack here, which I love, is buying secondhand. Sideline swap, mm -hmm. play it again sports, even eBay and Craigslist. We just got a lacrosse stick off of eBay, 50% off. It's wow. brand new. Daughter okay. loves it. So that is where you save the most on sporting goods. But wait till Labor Day if you want something brand new on sale. And what are those those web things you talk about? Those, those extensions. Those extensions. Like Honey, for example, those will give you 
you an idea of price mm -hmm. tracking when things are high and low. All right. Vicky, how do you do it? How, how do, do you keep do that all in that brain? We don't even know how that, did, how that happened. Encyclopedic we have knowledge. my moment. Hey, thanks for watching. Don't miss the Today Show every weekday at 11 a.m. Eastern, 8 Pacific, on our streaming channel, Today All Day. To watch, head to today.com slash all day or click the link right here.